Hi, my name is Jamie Landman, and I'm the Chair of the Department of Urology at the University of California, Irvine. My area of focus is largely in kidney disease, with a particular focus in kidney cancer and the minimally invasive management of that disease, as well as kidney stones, again with a minimally invasive focus, and, and pretty much anything that has to do with kidney surgery, so kidney blockage or kidney transplant. One of the major focuses of my practice is kidney stone disease and has been for three decades. Kidney stones are a massive problem around the country with now almost 10% of the American population having kidney stones at some point in their life. That doesn't sound that impressive until you realize that that was one third of that in the 70s and it continues to rise steadily. So what does that mean? It means that lifestyle and diet are massively affecting kidney stone disease and making this almost a national epidemic and quite frankly a pandemic although in today's era I'm, I'm afraid to use those words. The truth is if you have kidney stones you want the very best care. So when it comes to what traditionally is known as care, meaning the treatment strategies, shockwave lithotripsy, ureteroscopy, and percutaneous nephrolithotomy, we literally offer the best in the world. UCI Urology invested in having the best shockwave machine in the world, and this is the least invasive strategy that's really appropriate for some stones. For some stones that are a little bit more challenging, we offer ureteroscopy. The UCI Urology team has created much of the technology that people use for ureteroscopy today. The contemporary version of an access sheath, many endoscope modifications, and other techniques were devised here at UCI, and we have some of the best outcomes in the world. And finally, for really big stones, still minimally invasive, but a little less so, is percutaneous nephrolithotomy. And the technique used at, here at UCI was devised here at UCI by our team, and actually is now used all over the world. So, the combination of world-class surgical experience for those patients who need surgery, really smart active surveillance for smaller stones that can be watched, but most important, and the part that's often ignored, is the prevention. So we really focus on doing metabolic evaluations, making sure we understand why your body made those stones, and everybody's a little different, and every stone's a little different. And once we understand that, we work with the patient to craft a strategy that helps minimize future stone events. And that seems like a no-brainer, but it's not routinely done around the country and around the world. And that is a major focus here at UCI. Get you the very best stone treatment tailored specifically to you, and then make every effort to make sure you don't ever get that stone again.